Hi there. Today I'm going to show you how to get soccer or football data into your Google Sheets for free using an API. So what we're going to do first is go to rapidapi.com and search for a football API or soccer API. So just search football or soccer in the search bar at the top and you'll be presented with multiple uh, API options to choose from. Look through all the different APIs and look for an API that provides the data that you need. For this example, we're going to use this API-Football uh, by API Sports. The next thing you'll want to do is go to the Pricing tab and subscribe to the $0 per month plan. After you've subscribed to the $0 per month plan, head back over to the Endpoints tab. And in the Endpoints tab, you'll see a menu on the left of all the available endpoints that this API offers. So for example, this API offers endpoints for fixtures, for teams, for countries and seasons, for leagues, odds, events, standings, statistics, players, and more. For this example, let's look at the player's endpoint and let's get player statistics by player ID. So this endpoint will get us player statistics for a specific player and the, we can specify the team ID, the league ID, and the season. So once you've chosen your API and the endpoint that you want to use, the next thing you should do is open a Google Sheet, click Extensions, Add-ons, Get Add-ons, and search for the Epiphany add-on, which is spelled A-P-I-P-H-E-N-Y. After you've searched for and found the Epiphany add-on, go ahead and install it. After you've installed the Epiphany add-on, when you open or refresh your Google Sheet, you'll see Epiphany in your extensions menu like this. Go ahead and click Epiphany and then import API and the Epiphany add-on or sidebar will open in your Google Sheet just like this. Once you have Epiphany open, head back over to the API in Rapid API and in the endpoint that you've chosen, uh, change where it says Node.js, change this to shell curl, which will give us a better view of the URL and headers that we need to enter into Epiphany. So here we can see that the API URL uh, that we can copy and paste into Epiphany. So I'm going to copy that and then come to Epiphany and enter that URL right here in the API URL path. And we can see that this API URL uh, is getting statistics for player 276 from season 2020. Now we need to add two headers. So open the uh, or expand the headers tab and click add header twice so that two rows show up. Head back over to Rapid API and you can see the two headers that we need to enter right here. The first header is X Rapid API host. So I'm going to copy that and I'm going to paste it where it says new key. And I'm also going to copy the value, which is this API football v1 p rapid api.com. So I'm going to paste that in the value. And we have, we have one more header that we need to enter. The second one is x rapid API key. So I'm going to copy that. I'm going to paste it in the second header in Epiphany. And I'm going to copy my API key. And I'm also going to paste that in the value. So now we're ready to make our API request. We have our API URL and our two headers. So I'm going to open a new sheet and I'm going to click run, run again. Wait a moment. And we can see we've gotten the data directly in our Google sheet from that API. So this endpoint, we specified that we want to get the statistics for player 276 which in this case is Neymar. So we can see we got the name of the player, we have their age, their birth date, where they're from, their height, their weight, and a bunch of more uh, data or statistics about this player. So you can play around with this ID and the season number uh, to get statistics for different players. And once you've made a successful request uh, to that API that you've chosen, then you can play around with the other endpoints. Um, for example, 
maybe we want to get fixtures data or teams data or leagues or odds or events data. So once you've made a successful request by entering the API URL and headers, then you can play around with other endpoints. For example, let's look at player seasons endpoint. And we can see when we click on this endpoint, the URL has changed. So I'm going to copy the new URL. I'm going to come back to Epiphany. I'm going to paste it. And you can see this is different than the previous URL we had in there. But the headers are the same. So we don't need to make any changes to the header. It's XRapid API host and XRapid API key. So those are the same. All we have to do is change the URL. And we can make a new request to a different endpoint. So that's how you can browse Rapid API for soccer or football APIs. And most of the APIs in Rapid API have a free plan. And once you've chosen an API, you can get the Epiphany add-on for free and start making requests and getting the data in your Google Sheet. So I hope that's helpful. Feel free to let me know if you have any questions and have a great day.